Look at the size of that! What's going on all you cats and kittens? Bo here from BZ Hub bringing you the BZ news and this is a this is a big deal. I mean anytime a new map comes out it's a huge deal and so uh, we're gonna go into the map if you missed the stream today or if you just need a general recap this is the video for you so let's get into it. The first thing I'm sure you're wanting to know is that this is going to be a Rocky Mountain map. Um, it's kind of based in Colorado they said. They said it's kind of a Colorado based Rocky Mountain map and there are going to be nine animals on this map which is pretty cool. There are some new ones, some ones that have changed a little bit and then some just straight up copies that they use from other maps but uh you know anyway we'll go through them first up is mountain goats this was the first animal we saw in the stream because we were high up on a mountain in the rocky mountains and uh we got to see some mountain goats um we got to see a bunch of females and then we did see a male um i believe and then that was pretty much it for the mountain goats pretty stocky animals you know little horns up on top but uh, mountain goats indeed. Still pretty fun to be up there in the mountains and, and hunting a specific animal is, is a cool idea. Next up for the new animals is going to be the bighorn sheep. Uh, we got to see some bighorn sheep along with the da 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 turkeys um i'm sure you were all looking forward to the turkeys um and so we got to see the bighorn sheep and the turkeys and hopefully we'll get to see more of the bighorn sheep later on but right now it seems that the turkey models are a little inaccurate um the tail feathers don't really show much color um there's not a lot of detail going on they're the most bland turkey feathers i've ever seen in my entire life and then uh both the males and the females currently show red heads which is uh inaccurate and the females also have spurs so there's some things they need to change on the turkeys and they said that they, you know, um, they, you know, TK acknowledged that they were incorrect and that they would need to go back and change some things about the turkeys. So um, don't fret about that at the moment. Uh, mule deer. There are mule deer in the Rocky Mountain map. We didn't get to see any in the stream, but they are going to be there. No news on whether there's going to be any sort of true racks on the mule deer upon release. But uh, of course, there will be true racks at some point for the mule deer, hopefully just a whole revamping of the mule deer antlers in general um, but no news on that so far Rocky Mountain elk they do have a new model of elk and it looks fantastic it really does it, it looks really good uh, the Rocky Mountain elk is probably one of my favorite looking animals in the game right now um, Cecilia the modeler just did a fantastic job on the elk and the antlers look great as well um, I'd almost want them to just go to Layton and just change the elk and Layton to to be like the Rocky Mountain elk because they look they look really good they really do black bear there are black bear in the Rocky Mountain uh, map as well and uh, we didn't get to see much of them but they're basically the same animals as uh, are on Layton so uh, you know pretty much a copy and paste speaking of copies and pasting um, there are mountain lions in the Rocky Mountain map and it is just a copy of the Pumas from Park Okay, Fernando into the Rocky Mountain map and so uh, yeah so you have pumas who are now mountain lions and you have black bears and then on top of that they took the uh, Yukon Plains bison the American bison there and then moved him into the Rocky Mountain map as well so that is going to be yet another copy um, that's in the map but luckily those are pretty much the only copies honestly and then um, something pretty exciting I should say is that another addition to the Colorado Rocky Mountain map is going to be the pronghorn and that was really cool to finally see the pronghorn in all its might we actually got pretty lucky in the stream he did find a level 5 diamond pronghorn there so that was pretty cool we got to see kind of what the top um, and not even the top because you can totally see that one horn was much bigger than the other horn so you can imagine that uh, you know when you hit a really big size uh, you know pronghorn it's gonna have two of those massive horns and that's that's that is, that's gonna be a giant antelope so that is gonna be really cool something I didn't mention before is that the Rocky Mountain maps name is going to be Silver Ridge Peaks um, no news yet on what the uh, little logo is going to look like but uh, yes yeah, Silver Ridge Peaks which is different than the Timber Gold Trails I want to say in the Hunter Classic so that is pretty cool different name there but just referencing the snowy tops of the mountains as you can imagine they did mention that this is going to be the biggest map 
that they've ever made for the game. And that's not talking about the the map in general. I'm sure you know they did talk about this um, a time or two before. But the maps are like, I don't remember what they said, 20 kilometers in size. And then the playable area is like 14 kilometers in size. It might be 14 and 16 or 14 and 18, something like that. But uh, they're, the playable size in this map is actually larger than others. So you might be looking at 15 kilometers by 15 kilometers. Um, so that is pretty cool. Larger playable size there for all of these um, Rocky Mountain animals. Remy Warren, who we uh, learned about in the uh, last clue that they posted before releasing uh, this uh, stream on the Rocky Mountain map, showed Remy Warren hunting some turkeys, and uh, I did a video on that as well. If you haven't seen that, check that out. Um, but they did say that he will be featured in the game somehow. So that will be interesting to see if it's going to be like a character model or what it may be. Interesting. I'm thinking, if you want to know what I think, uh, I could be totally wrong, but uh, I am wondering if he will be the uh, the kind of narrator of the story missions, you know, saying, you know, hey, you know, my name's Remy Warren and, uh, you know, I've been doing some outfitting in these parts for a while. I don't know how Remy talks, but that's that's how that's what I imagine is going to be going on but we will see what's going to be happening because I really don't know there is gonna be a new weapon with this map um, they didn't tell us what it would be they just wanted to spark some uh, mystery about it hopefully but hopefully um, we will learn what that weapon is going to be next week during their stream they kind of wanted to space things out they acted um, I keep saying they but it's really just TK TK acted as if um, it was going to be a little while till this map um, is going to be released and that brings me to another thing there is no current release date of the map but we should know that they did talk about a stream next week um, detailing some stuff and they wanted to be clear that the stream the game in the stream was was an in development build there was a lot of things they needed to correct a lot of things they needed to improve on before this got released to the public which I'm sure a lot of you appreciate so uh, yeah that's uh, that's basically the Rocky Mountain map there we did get to see like I said we got to see a diamond pronghorn which was really cool to see something that large and then we got to see a leucistic turkey which was also pretty cool so um, that's that's pretty much it everyone we flew around the map we saw the map in general we got to fly around there are some birch trees there's some mountains there's some you know conifer forests and all that stuff and then there's kind of they called it the plains area but it's not it's not really a plains area it's like open gaps of meadow between trees which is not <laughs> if you've been between Kansas and Colorado you would know that it is uh, an ocean of hills as far as the eye can see until you see the uh, Rocky Mountains so uh, yeah it's not exactly a plains area like I was picturing but you know what that kind of the area is kind of boring anyway it's just a bunch of grass um, and, and hills and meadows so you know this is probably better uh, than that anyway so anyway I, I'm pretty excited for uh, Silver Ridge Peaks it's gonna be what looks like a pretty cool map I was really looking forward to an Australian map as I'm sure a few of you also were but uh, this is looking to be really cool I'm looking forward to seeing more Bighorn learning about the new weapon um, in the next stream and um, yeah I don't know if there's anything else I'm really questioning at the moment I guess we'll learn what Remy Warren is gonna be doing um, and that's about it Hopefully we see a trophy lodge, a new log cabin trophy lodge in the near future after this release because I'm going to feel weird putting my uh, my Rocky Mountain animals into a European lodge or a, you know, a, a Sasika Safari lodge, right? That's going to be a little strange, but hey, we're just going to have to be forced to until a new log cabin lodge comes out, um, but that's pretty much it, everyone. Really appreciate you watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. I've seen, I've seen the analytics. A lot of you aren't subscribed. Hit the subscribe button bro as you can see we're here to stay we're, we're busy hub man we're having fun having fun hunting fishing outdoor adventures in general as well as just random random things thrown in but hopefully you're having a fun time i'm having a fun time and uh that's it that's it Maine. Check us out on Twitch Monday, Wednesday, sometimes Friday, 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Central. Hope to see you there. My brother Z is on Twitch. Look him up at Zacchaeus on Twitch. Um, check him out. He plays some other games as well. Fun guy to watch and talk to. Interesting dude, and he's pretty cool. Um, and that's going to do it. As always, hunters.
keep gaming, never stop.